All right, Roseville's newest restaurant is looking to provide a full dining experience with food, espresso, even a full bar. Kevin Hernandez live in Roseville with a peek at their cocktail menu. Hey, Kevin. Hey, yeah, so what I love about 105 Noshery is they say it's not just a restaurant, it's an experience. And so speaking of experience here, we have Justine, who is the 105 Noshery bartender. Okay, so Justine, you're dishing out some of your signature cocktails, and you guys use fresh produce, is that right? Absolutely. We have a herb garden outside that Diana's going to come show you guys in a minute. So I'm muddling fresh mint this morning, making our bourbon smash and our tequila smash. So tell us a little bit about those beverages because you came up with those all on your own. I mean, again, you're one of the founding people here at 105 Noshery. So, I mean, you came up with this bar menu. So when you were researching cocktails, I mean, what kind of you know research did you do to make them like this? So our whole cocktail menu is based around the original speakeasy prohibition style cocktails. The way I came up with the smash is, you know, old school Kentucky Derby gin juleps. Mm -hmm. But the smash is like a julep, you just add fruit. So I thought it would be fun to use our herb wall, add in some seasonal fruit, and create an entire smash cocktail menu. I love that. So while you're doing that, I want to show off, this is one of Justine's signature Bloody Marys here. So when they said earlier about the bacon, I mean, check out that thick piece of bacon. I mean, holy cow. And then what I love, too, is, is we have a lovely couple right here who just got here, front row. They're big, good debuters. And you know what? I think they might get to actually have these cocktails here. They didn't know that, but it looks like you're going to start drinking early today. Very Sunday nice. fun day, right? <laughs> um, so we're going to come back in just a second and check in on Justine's drink. But I want to come outside really quick. So, Steve, follow me out this way, because we have this um, really great herb wall, speaking of which, that Justine was talking about. So we're here with Diana, who's one of the managers here at Noshery. So this herb wall that you guys have here, this is all what you use inside the restaurant. And so people can actually come out here and you will give them fresh herbs to take home, right? Absolutely, absolutely. So what you can do is you can, this is a chocolate mint right here. You can just pick it up like this and put it in a bag and you get to take it home. I love that. So, I mean, you have some really great stuff here. Garlic chives, you have, um, let's see, basil down here. So, again, if somebody likes that, what was in their cocktail, what was in their yep. food, they just ask you, and then there they go, right? Absolutely, absolutely. I love it. Thank you so much. Okay, let's go back in really quickly. We're going to check in on Justine and check out her drinks here. We got some people dining out this morning here. Really beautiful morning to do that. Okay, so we're ready to see the finished product, Justine. And so while we're at it, I want to encourage you to come down here to 105 Noshery. It's 105 Vernon Street. Yeah, she's shaking them up there. 105 Vernon Street. They are officially open now, been open a month. Come out and support the local businesses out here. And here we go. We're going to watch the slow motion pour. And with that mint, I bet you it's really fresh, right, Justine? Yes, it is, right out of the herb wall. I love it. I love it so much. Thank you again. And again, you two right there, you enjoy your cocktails on Thank Good you. Day Sacramento. <laughs> <laughs> well, send it on back to you guys in studio. Thank you, Kevin. Wow, what a deal. Everything looks so tasty and delicious, even uh, very refreshing as well. Check them out.